Turns out, the formation of our galaxy is connected to another smaller galaxy, Sagittarius. The Sagittarius Dwarf Spheroidal Galaxy is a satellite galaxy of our home galaxy, the Milky Way. It has a loopy and spirally path that over billions of years has passed through the Milky Way's disk on several occasions. So, what do these crashes look like? And how have they affected our galaxy and solar system? Here's what scientists discovered. A new study published in the journal Nature Astronomy using data from Gaia, a space observatory from the European Space Agency, shows the effects of the Sagittarius Dwarf Spheroidal Galaxy on the formation of the Milky Way Galaxy. Due to gravitational forces, the Sagittarius Dwarf Galaxy crashes time and time again through the Milky Way's disk. One of these collisions occurred roughly at the same time as the formation of our Sun, around 4.7 billion years ago. It is possible this impact contributed to the Sun's creation. The team of researchers examined luminosities, distances, and colors of stars within 6,500 light-years around the Sun and then compared the information with already available stellar evolution models to understand the effects of the crashes. Data from Gaia showed three periods of increased star formation. There were peaks 5.7 billion years ago, 1.9 billion years ago, and 1 billion years ago. These periods coincide with times where the Sagittarius Dwarf Galaxy is believed to have crashed through the disk of the Milky Way. The Sagittarius Dwarf Spheroidal Galaxy is also responsible for why our galaxy is warped. Here is how. Researchers say collisions with other galaxies might be why the Milky Way is bent out of shape. The European Space Agency's space observatory Gaia may have found an explanation for the warped shape of the Milky Way galaxy, which is bent into an S-shape. This warp rotates with the galaxy's stars instead of standing still. The European Space Agency launched Gaia in 2013 to render a 3D map of the Milky Way. The agency says the survey will eventually take a spatial census of 1 billion stars in our galaxy, or 1% of its constituents. A study published in Nature Astronomy says that an ongoing collision with another galaxy, most likely the dwarf satellite galaxy Sagittarius, has disrupted the dish shape of our galaxy. Citing the authors, the European Space Agency says that Gaia mapped out the motions, velocity and distance of our galaxy's stars. The researchers then worked backward to determine when and how collisions with Sagittarius deformed our galactic dish. And if you're a space fan, you'll be pleased to know that the iconic Hubble telescope is getting a sibling, one that undoubtedly will give us even more breathtaking images of our universe. Meet Nancy Roman, NASA's planned telescope that will succeed the Hubble. NASA has renamed its next-generation Wide Field Infrared Survey Telescope after Nancy Roman, the agency's first chief astronomer known as the mother of Hubble. NASA plans to launch the Roman Space Telescope in the mid-2020s. Nancy Roman joined NASA just six months after the agency's establishment in 1959. According to NASA Administrator Jim Bridenstine, quote, It is because of Nancy Grace Roman's leadership and vision that NASA became a pioneer in astrophysics and launched Hubble. The Roman Space Telescope has a silvered primary mirror array that is 2.4 meters wide about the same size as the Hubble's. The Roman will include the 300-megapixel wide-field instrument, which has a field of view 100 times greater than the Hubble's infrared instrument. One image from the Roman will hold as much detail as 100 Hubble images. In addition, the new telescope will carry the coronagraph instrument, a high-contrast imaging and spectroscopy device. The Roman will survey the Milky Way with the aim of finding around 2,600 exoplanets. Its primary mission will last five years, with another five in a potential extended mission. NASA also plans to use the Roman Space Telescope to find clues about dark energy, which could yield the key to understanding the expansion of the cosmos. For more news animations and explainers, hit the subscribe and bell button to join the Tomo News family. Thanks for watching.